Hey guys, Mike here from Jet Tech. Just gonna show you how to fit a set of racks to the Sea-Doo ST3 hulls. Very important to start off and make sure you have your racks set up uh, correct. So hole number two on the bottom hull support plate and option number two for your upper hull support plate. So when clamping your racks on, just come up and underneath, pull up on the inner jaw and do up one knob lightly. Make sure the inner jaw is as high as it can possibly go. Your upper jaw is sitting nicely in the ridge there and it's nice and flush on the bottom. When doing up your knobs, you wanna make sure to do them both up at the same time with even tension. Then give it a bit of a shake and nip them up one more time. Very important to make sure that your racks are sitting vertical. They're not slanted outwards or inwards. If so, that means you've got the wrong sitting on your bottom hull support plate. So that's how you correctly fit the racks to the SD3 hull. So when slotting your boards in, if you're using surfboards, it's always wax sides face each other and fins at opposite ends. That way the boards interlock. And you can see how the racks are actually profiled to match a surfboard profile. If you're using wakeboards or knee boards and etc. like that, you can put them any way around you like. When doing the bungees, if you're using one board, you can shorten it on that side and go over. Now your boards are nice and secure and safe, you're not going to be cracking your rails, you're not scratching your ski and you've freed up your leg room.